With so much content whizzing around out there, there's only one storytelling platform that helps you keep calm and stay informed and inspired. Flipboard. Flipboard curates the world's stories so you can be smarter in your work, life, and play. Choose from thousands of topics to personalize Flipboard and get the latest stories from the best publishers and experts delivered to you 24-7. When you see stories you want to save or share, tap the plus button to add them to private or public collections. It's that simple. Used by millions of people every day, Flipboard is how people move themselves and the world forward. Get started now at Flipboard.com. It's the E-Commerce Minute, your daily dose of e-commerce, tech, and retail news with your hosts, Bart Moraz and John Suter. The E-Commerce Minute is a production of Sumo Heavy, a digital commerce consulting firm in Brooklyn, New York, and Philadelphia. Find us on the web at sumoheavy.com. It's E-Commerce Minute, episode number 200. In today's episode, Boxed unveils Prime Style Subscription. Bulk online shopping site Boxed last week unveiled a new premium service called Boxed Up. The service comes with member perks like 2% cash rewards, free priority shipping, and access to special promotions. In addition, members get VIP customer service and price matching for competitors, all for 49 bucks a year. According to Ash Prashar, VP of Communications for Boxed, the company decided to roll out Boxed Up now as a premium service because customers were asking for deeper discounts and unique promotions. So we decided to roll out a premium service that rewards loyal customers with perks and promotion for shopping on Boxed, he said. One of the big differences between this and the traditional service is the free two-day shipping on all orders versus free for orders over $49. Exclusives include deals on the Boxed Hotel's booking site, extra entries for prizes like Vitamixes, Keurigs, and Dyson fans, and special discounts worked out between Box and the likes of Keurig, Pepsi, and Kraft, he said. Box customers, including consumer or business accounts, can try out the premium service for a 30-day free trial. Otherwise, for those not in the Boxed Up tier, Shipping is free on orders for over $49, and the company says that most arrive within two business days. The launch of Boxed Up is the New York-based retailer's latest attempt to be a serious competitor in the increasingly competitive grocery e-commerce market. Box it up. Ooh, Box it up. Boxed. Costco for millennials. It's Costco <laughs> for millennials. <laughs> because the millennials don't like to go to Costco. They just want to push a button on their phone and order the stuff. Well, have you heard our story before? It's a big generous treasure hunt at Costco. Oh, well, yeah. They, <laughs> millennials get lost in there. <laughs> yeah. So, obviously, this is a, trying to compete with Prime. Um, it's interesting because some of these membership models don't exactly work out. We all remember how Jet started out. They abandoned that pretty quickly. And I know Walmart, when they had something called, uh, what was the Walmart one? I don't uh, remember. There was a Walmart one. Yeah. I, it, was like yeah a, it was like you pay a bulk rate for shipping and they dropped it right yeah. away. Yeah. I think this is going to last a lot longer just because Box is, is pretty popular. Um, they do a lot of th- you know, promotions and they actually do some exclusive deals with some, some um, companies. So that's kind of always interesting. Yeah. And I think that's the, that's a, that's a big differentiator when, you joined something like, because I remember when Jet came out, and I was like, oh, this is great. The prices are great, but I'm getting, I'm paying $50. And when you, you, when you shine the light of like Amazon Prime, which you pay, well, it used to be 75, then it was 90, now it's over $100. But still, you think about all the stuff you get with Prime, and then you look, you right. compare, you, you, it's not apples to apples, it's apples to a freaking truck full of apples. So what they're doing is they've, they've, at, they're, they're following Amazon's lead and offering a lot more stuff with the membership. So I think it makes a lot of sense. Yeah, this is gonna be interesting. Um, I mean, I overall like boxed. Um, the problem is like, I have a small apartment, so I don't really buy Jen Elmas things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, or the inverse is like, I think this is a really great deal. And then you're sitting on like, you know, 70 boxes of mac and cheese that you might not ever eat. Yeah, no, not out of the box, no thanks. The boxed cheese is not, not good. So uh, box has become itself a bit of a target um, as the grocery, you know, we've reported a lot on the grocery space. Um, it's, it's super interesting. I don't know. I mean, if you look at some of the stories we've done, we've really focused on the grocery e-commerce space. It's a super interesting place right now, hyper competitive. Um, and it's going to be interesting to see where it goes. In fact, Kroger, we've done some stories on Kroger as well. Uh, they were looking at boxed and boxed actually turned down an offer from Kroger uh, between three hundred and four hundred million dollars. So these guys are definitely in for the long run. Oh yeah, they're either going the long run or that that number is way too low for them. So in some of the articles I saw, uh, they they fo- kind of focus on the millennial consumer 
Uh, and the thought is that millennials demonstrate that they're willing to pay more for premium services and discounts. So it's good to take advantage of that. And, um, you know, they, they feel that the millennial customer is going to pay a little more when they think they're getting more of a value. Uh, and I think it's great. Yep. It's a great tactic. I think it's value. Yeah. Value and convenience for that. It's value. Oh, and obviously convenience because millennials, they just want to push buttons and not go to the store. So it's, you know, you like to push buttons too and not go to the store. I do. So. I do. I'm guilty. You're definitely not a millennial. Hey, what's my time worth? That's what I always say. I, you've heard me say it in many podcasts. It's like, I, if I have, it takes too long to figure it out and it's not, you know, I, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta do that la little math equation in your head. So, all right. Good for boxed. Uh, we'll keep an eye on that one. Uh, anything else to add, Bart? No, that's it. Let's box this up. Let's box, <laughs> let's box this up. As always, our show notes are available on our website, ecommerceminute.co. That's your e-commerce minute for today. We'll see you on the internet tomorrow. Let's box this up. That's it for today's show. If you like the show, do us a favor and subscribe or leave us a review on iTunes. And don't forget, you can now listen to the e-commerce minute on your Amazon device. Just add e-commerce minute to your flash briefing. And finally, if you have a comment or suggestion or just want to say hi, find us on social media at Sumo Heavy. <laughs>